Hello, ladies and gentlemen of uh, TikTok, YouTube, Rumble, wherever I decide to post this. Okay, hello, my name is Kendo, and, uh, well, let, let's just talk uh, about commentators. Now, we're not talking about Fox News or freaking... I, I, I choose specifically not to talk about Fox News because they freaking suck. Um, I, I, I don't like Fox, okay? I never did. And guess what? Fox technically is no longer Fox. Technically, the Fox I know is 20th Century Studios now, and they're part of Disney, so I don't care about any of the other Fox companies, you know, uh, whatever. Okay, so let's talk about uh, commentators. Now, the modern-day commentary is just a worse version of the commentary we had about 13, 14 years ago. When I'm, I like to, 2010, I made commentary videos. Of course, they were never any good, but then again, we were dealing with less better technology. And to be honest with you, I don't even do commentaries anymore. I mean, the last time I did a commentary, I did a commentary on Chet Goldstein and his getting swatted, which, would, by the way, was fucking hilarious. But the point of the matter is that I like to make fun of uh, situations, but if I'm going to make fun of situations, I'm not going to post it on YouTube. If I'm going to make fun of a situation, like, for example, Chet Goldstein, well, other than that, no, no, that was actually, that was actually, like, literally just me just being funny and just, I hate that guy so much that Chet, Chet is one of the worst people in the fucking world, okay, because not only is he a bigot, not only is he a hateful bigot, not only is he a lying sack of shit, but he also, of course, of course, he also uh, is money hungry as shit, and he does he does all all his catches for the money, which is hilarious. But uh, there is one thing I kind of agree with him on, and that is that commentators kind of had it coming. When I say that, I mean there was a situation a while ago, which of course Kendo was the uh, the instigator of this uh, set of circumstances. <laughs> Uh, so basically, uh, I noticed that everyone and their mother was doing, you know, EDP videos, and this is the truth. This is one hundred percent true. A lot of people say that I'm, I just make talk out of my ass, but no, t trust me, I do. I do report these videos. I do report these videos to YouTube, and the, a lot of the ones I reported got taken down immediately. Well, not immediately. Actually, technically, they did. But anyway, point being, I reported. These videos, from, not only from uh, some of the channels like, you know, Gideon or whatever, whatever the hell, uh, but also, of course, uh, some of the commentators, the some of the commentators, Turkey Tom, or, or Tom Dark, I should say, Tom Dark, because I, he has two channels, Turkey Tom and Tom Dark. To be honest with you, I don't like the guy. The guy is like an hour and a half away, basically, like an hour and a half away. He's over in Boston area, from what I understand, and uh, I'm here in Southern Maine. But point being, guys, point being, all right, uh, I reported his video, I reported Briz's videos. I already had reported two of Briz, Briz's videos that I violated, and they go, both got taken down, so he was on his second strike, and he made a video on that, and I was laughing my ass off. And the worst part is, uh, I, I kept telling these guys that on Twitter, and they were X, X, and uh, they never, they never, they never, you know, they never came at me. They, uh, they probably don't believe that I actually freaking reported said content, but I did, you know, and they got taken down because of my reports. So, uh, just to let you guys know, I mean, it's just, it is what it is. But point being, the modern day commentators are doing this thing, this thing worse. They're comparing their content to fair use, right? And which is absurd because their content in general belittles people, harasses people, doxes people, and bullies people, basically. Their in solely intent for their content is to bully, belittle, harass, defame, dox. That's what they want to do with their content. It's not even, it's not even good content, okay? Look at Turkey Tom's freaking all of his fucking uh, documentaries. All of them are rushed, super rushed, and they required little to no effort, to be honest with you. And the worst part is that they consider that this, you know, belittling people and you know harassing people and bullying people, you know, all these insults they use, all of them think that that's covered under fair use because it's in the form of a commentary. That is not a commentary, guy. That's that's not even a critique. That is harassment. Belittling someone. You're belittling, literally belittling someone. That is not considered critique. Critique is criticism, okay? And by the way, 
criticism can be constructive in the hopes that somebody improves or criticism can be just you don't like the person okay like take a look at how I freaking basically talk about Chet I talk about Chet or any of these catchers because they're awful people and I think they're awful people but I'm not sitting there like doxing them I'm not sitting there oh this guy's so fed blah, 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 blah. I, now granted I do get pissed off in some of my <laughs> videos I do get pissed off with their shenanigans you know and uh, the worst the worst part is I mean I'm guilty of that but but let me tell you <laughs> critique is still what I would classify it, it as it's not a commentary it's not a commentary it's not a documentary okay if you're making this content to basically belittle someone and defame somebody okay that's not commentary it's, it's not even critique it's not a documentary I mean the worst thing you can say is it's a documentary and uh, Turkey Tom makes all sorts of documentaries mostly designed to harass people and bully people but worst thing it's not even criticism not even criticism because your criticism has to be constructive or at the very least it has to be in a certain context right so I mean I could sit, literally sit there and say oh well Chuck Goldstein you know um, deserved to get swatted or it was funny that he got swatted but I also have to stress in my video that you should not probably swat somebody you know uh, although I don't although I have nothing to say because I, I wasn't involved in that situation but again commentary is a little bit different I think with a commentary you're commentating over the subject of the video and you're supposed to actually provide feedback okay these guys aren't providing feedback they're just throwing out insults take a look at Briz all of his videos all of his comment uh, like his comments like when he actually speaks with his voice all of that is basically borderline borderlining on a harassment and it's absolutely ridiculous these, these commentators are freaking ridiculous to be honest with you um, but I mean <laughs> kind of hard when I say you know uh, to be honest with you I don't even do commentaries anymore I mean that that Chet Goldstein commentary was just because I was you know, freaking having a riot. I was, you know, just laughing my ass off with the freaking video. I had seen it for a while, but I was just like, kind of being rude, you know. But I'll be honest, I wasn't that bad in that commentary compared to some of these guys, like Turkey Tom, Briz. Uh, even Review Tech USA pissed me off with this freaking quote unquote commentary over dumb shit. Um, anyway, this is Kendo, and uh, farewell, ladies and gentlemen.